Hey everyone, Miss Nimsay here. This is Lap Guy for round 6 of the GR Super GT Cup on Red Bull Ring. Let's get this started. Start your break in between the 150 and the 100 meter mark. You want to do all your braking before you start to turn. And once you start to turn, you want to transition from going from braking to going at around half throttle or even just a little under. Once you hit the apex, you can then go out full throttle. By doing all this, your car should slide as little as possible. The less it slides, the better you'll do and you'll go faster out of the turn. Quick note here, while I had the brake balance at zero when I got this lap, I also had it at one during other laps and got similar results, so feel free to experiment around and see what works with you best. Brake just after passing the 150 meter mark. By braking right here, this should give you enough space to be able to actually hit the apex head on. And make sure you start to accelerate after you pass the apex because if you accelerate a little too soon, you risk hitting the yellow bump that's a little past the apex. And with the elevation change, that can risk your car spinning out. Another quick note, if you haven't tried the Supra after the May 2019 update, I encourage you to do so as it's a lot more stable and it's not trying to kill you as much as it was before. For this turn, brake exactly at the 150 meter mark. This should give you the perfect amount of distance to make this turn. So as you're going down the hill, go into fourth gear. And once you're starting to turn, go into third gear. By doing this, this should force your car to rotate just the perfect amount so you can then start to accelerate once you're about to pass the yellow line that you see on the screen here. Break before you reach the 50 meter mark. Make sure you're starting to turn by the time you shift down to fourth gear because the car will rotate a little bit. Do a lot of throttle control and once your car is starting to point towards the other side of the track, start to fully accelerate. Brake just after the piece of track on the right joins with the rest of the track. So as you go into the turn, you can lift off the brake to force the car to rotate. That way you can stay in the inside and get the turn done. And by the time you're about to pass the official stand that's on your left, you can start to fully accelerate. Make sure your car is not on the green too much because there's a little dip that can throw your car out of control. Brake just after passing the 100 meter mark. You want to get your car to slide just a little bit, so be aware about how much uh, brake that you're lifting as you go through this turn. Do some throttle control and then start to brake before the striped area on your left ends. For this particular turn, you don't want the car to slide too much. So do all your braking and then go half throttle to the turn and as you can start to fully accelerate once you're past the apex. And that's all for the guide. Non-commentary version is coming up, but anyways, thank you for watching the video. This is Mr. MCA, the world's most okay player, and I'll see you in the next video.